probably have to give a little credit to the West Indies bowlers as well. They came in with a set plan this morning to uh, keep it tight and not give away easy runs. They tried to bowl fourth, fifth uh, stump channel, and uh, you know the wicket obviously isn't um, the easiest to bat on. It is a little you know spongy sometimes and two pace, so you couldn't play through the line or go after the bowling when they bowl those channels. And um, yeah, so. You know, you need. It's a test match. You have all the time in the world. We've bundled them out for 180, and we still have four days to go. So we were in no hurry. So we could take take our time and you know wait for the loose balls. I think we played uh, we played really well in the first session. We gave uh, the West Indies bowlers and the the lengths and lines they were bowling the respected demanded. And uh, you know, um, yeah, at the end of the day, we we we've still gotten the amount of runs we wanted to get. So uh, we were very happy as a batting unit. He bowled really good areas and he was uh, challenging us in every spell. Um, yeah, so we knew, we obviously know that Gabriel is one of the strike bowlers and West Indies uh, look at him for wickets and uh, he comes in short bursts in three and four overs, tries to bowl quick and tries to get a few wickets. But yeah, our plan against him was to you know see him through and give him. Uh, Give the ball the respect it demanded, and now uh, you know put the bad balls away. So I think we did very well today and yesterday.